While walking to work one day, a hairdresser notices a beautiful homeless girl with piercing brown eyes on the street. He offers to cut her hair, not knowing it would soon lead her to find her family again. Andrew was a 25-year-old hairdresser. He dreamed of having his own salon one day, but he was still saving up and trying to learn all the tips and tricks from his current boss. One day, while walking to work, he spotted a woman on the street begging for alms. Her clear white skin drew his attention right away, in spite of her unkempt light brown hair, which almost covered her whole face. Andrew dug through his pocket and fished out a $5 bill to hand to her. The girl barely raised her head as she said thank you, but Andrew spotted her piercing light brown eyes. Such beautiful eyes. He couldn't help but whisper. Upon hearing this, the girl quickly lowered her head again. I'd like to give you something, Andrew told her. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and click the notification bell for more amazing stories. Come with me. I work right there, he said, pointing to the salon just a few steps away. She slowly stood up and followed him silently. When they got to the salon, there was no one there. Andrew asked her to take a seat at the shampoo chair. I'd like to give you a makeover, he told her. While he was washing her hair, the woman silently cried, surprised that someone had noticed her and offered to give her a free makeover. She had never met anyone so kind in the past couple of years. She'd been living on the street. Andrew led her to one of the salon chairs and started to cut her hair. He trimmed her locks and gave her a layered haircut, highlighting her beautiful brunette locks. By the time he finished, Andrew was in shock. She was the most beautiful girl he had ever seen, and he couldn't help but wonder why she ended up in the streets. He swung the chair towards the mirror so the woman could look at herself. How do you like your new look? He asked her. She sobbed as she stared back at the girl she couldn't recognize in the mirror. She swung her hand to cover her mouth before revealing that she had not been to a beauty salon in more than four years. Thank you so much, sir, she told him. I will never forget what you did for me today. I'm glad I was able to make you happy. You look beautiful with your new haircut. What is your name? Andrew decided to ask her. My name is Megan, she replied quietly, barely looking Andrew in the eyes. It's very nice to meet you, Megan. One second, I am just going to rinse my hands in the washroom. Unfortunately, by the time Andrew returned, Megan was gone. She left a note by the counter, saying, I am infinitely grateful to you, but I am very ashamed and uncomfortable to look into your eyes. Thank you. Andrew was slightly disappointed that the woman left without saying goodbye. He wanted to get to know her more. Now it was too late. The entire time he was working, Andrew couldn't stop thinking about Megan. During his lunch break, he tried to check the place where he first saw her sitting, but she wasn't there. A few days later, he was closing up the salon when he was surprised to see Megan enter, but this time with a man who looked to be about 50 years old. Andrew thought the woman had brought her boyfriend until he realized they had the same brown eyes and hair. My daughter here told me what you did for her, the man suddenly spoke. We just wanted to thank you. Because of you, I found her, he said, extending his hand for Andrew to shake. I was about to sit back down in the place where you first saw me, but then one of my dad's employees spotted me. He took a photo and it reached my dad, Megan revealed. I'd been living in the streets with my face covered for four years. It's only now that someone finally recognized me, and it's all thanks to you, she said, finally flashing a smile at Andrew. Andrew was glad he helped Megan find her family again, but he was curious about why Megan ended up on the streets in the first place, so he decided to ask. Megan revealed that when she was younger, she ran away from home so she could do whatever she wanted with her friends. At the time, she and her parents were constantly fighting. During their last fight, 
Megan screamed at her parents and told them that she hated them. If I could just choose my family, I would rather choose poor, homeless parents than have you too, she said before running out the door. Unfortunately, she soon realized that her friends were no good for her. They were a bad influence on her, so she eventually cut ties with them altogether. However, she was too afraid to return to her parents after yelling at them, so she ended up on the streets. I thought they'd never accept me again, Megan admitted. While Megan spoke, Andrew was mesmerized by her beauty. He wanted so badly to ask her out on a date, but he realized it would be inappropriate, so he simply told her that he was happy to help. When Megan and her father left, she gave Andrew a look he could not understand. He wondered if she was trying to tell him something, but he soon shrugged it off as just his imagination. However, he soon found a note she apparently left on the counter for him. The note read, Tuesday, 7, 0 P. M. Simon's Bar. I'm looking forward to it. Andrew smiled. He counted the days until Tuesday, when the pair went on a date. It didn't take long after, before they realized they were in love, and they got married a few months later. Megan's dad was so grateful to Andrew for bringing his daughter back to him. And when he saw Andrew's potential as a hairdresser, he decided to invest in him so he could open his own beauty salon. Together with Megan, Andrew started to manage his own place, which ended up being the new go-to salon in town. The couple lived happily and expanded their family by having children, much to the delight of Megan's parents. What can we learn from this story? Doing good things can reap the most unexpected rewards. Andrew decided to give Megan a makeover without expecting anything in return. In the end, doing so led him to find the greatest love of his life. Forgiveness brings about new beginnings. Megan thought her parents would never forgive her for what she did, but they welcomed her back with open arms. Forgiving their daughter brought about new beginnings, where they were able to complete their family again, this time with new additions. Share this story with your friends. It might brighten their day and inspire them. Binding bonds through beautiful tales. Thank you for watching.